Hey guys, it's your girl Keish. Welcome back to the Keish TV and welcome to the Mukbang Rebels Healthy Eating Edition, aka the Keish's Healthy Eating Segment. We are with the Mukbang Rebels. We're eating for a cause. We like our portion small because we want to stay in charge of our health, our wealth. We're trying to set a trend to always eat healthy until the very end. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. And today, you guys, I have for you a chicken taco bowl. My way. Because it doesn't have all the bells and whistles in it like that. I just basically have some uh, ground chicken, some um, Mexican cheese, Mexican shredded cheese that I'm they melted on top of it with some lettuce and a little salsa. I didn't have no uh, sour cream or anything like that, so, you know. It is what it is. And I am drinking water out my coldest water bottle, aka Big Gert. Y'all, Big Gert is in the building. And guess what? Big Gert will do what? Save you in a crisis. Yes, she will. Yes, she will. Now, to get a Big Gert or a Big Swole, it will be in the description box below on how to get one. Let me go ahead on, put Big Gert down. And. Say my grace and I'm gonna get into it. God is good, God is great. Thank you for the meal we're about to receive. Bless your holy name, God is the meal. Amen. Amen, you guys. So what's going on with you guys tonight? Let me know what you're eating and if you're eating with me. Also, let me know what's going on in y'all neck of the woods, how's your weather treating you, and what y'all did today. Now, the um what we were supposed to do, we were supposed to uh have uh stuffed chicken breast but I hadn't gotten to the store and I don't have any uh I can't do the chicken breast anyway because it's too lean so you know I need I need the uh fat or whatever you wanna call it however but anyway I didn't have any chicken breast or even thighs you know that I could do but I did have brown chicken so what I did, I had ground chicken and ground beef mixture. So what I did was I just seasoned it, cooked it up, and made a taco bowl, y'all. All right, that's what it looks like. All right, uh -oh. this is what, uh, this is a cup and a third of my chicken, ground chicken and ground beef mix. I have uh, a tablespoon and a half of my of salsa. I have a third cup metric in there. And I have a third cup of cheese. So, what's going on with you guys? I was supposed to go to the doctor today, but, but I didn't get a chance to. But I did get on the scale and um, I weighed myself. I mean, it's bittersweet because I was looking for something like 350, 355, but I'm 358. That's uh 25 pounds. I don't know. I'm down 25 pounds. And um, I mean, it's a good thing. It's a good thing, but I wanted more, you know. And I'm noticing I'm losing slow. And steady. And it's okay. But I know I can do better. And I will. And I think that's due to the fact that I was struggling. That I was struggling with it. And now that I'm not struggling the way I was. 
after focus on hitting the ground running, you hear me? So that's a good thing. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I wanted to just, one day I wanted to just quit it and be like, you know what? I don't, I don't care. But it was like my conscience was like, really? Do you really not care? You know, you went, you went got your nails done, which I don't know, y'all you know, you know, can see, I got my nails done. You know, I had a girl day with my cuz. I had a good day, I was able to get out and do, I mean, I'm always able to get out. But I had a girl's day with my cuz, because I don't have any friends and out chill that I could do that with, you know. I got my family and you know when they want to be bothered with the girl, they bother. But um I was in my chair and um I want to have my girls there not in no chair. And you know what I mean I could still do it not in the chair. But I um been having back pain and for some reason I went to do squats and my knee it just went crack. I'm like, what in the hell? Disney right here. The fiber of my elder league at that. It went crack. I'm like, what? When I did my first squat, crack. I just said, you know what? I know that's probably bad, but I got to get through this. I was only able to do 10 squats because it was hurting so bad, so bad. And it wasn't the fact that my body was hurting, it was my knee. My knee, oh my God. Every time I went down like for a squat, it go crack, crack, crack. I'm like, oh, uh -uh. Mm -mm. But I had to, I pushed through it, even though I know I should have just, mm, not did all that and just run it on and continue to do my chair exercises, but I'm to the point, mm -mm. it's time to do more than chair exercises. Get your ass up, move, do this, do that, mm-mm, mm-mm. Them chair exercises, yeah. I'll go, you like it. And I'm talking to myself in third person. You sure all know you like to check sizes. It's an excuse. We need to let that go. Don't get me wrong. I know you have a bad back. I understand all that. But when you can get out that chair and do, the, do them other exercises, like the walking and stuff, you do it. Because I've seen it. You walk when you're going somewhere. You walk here, you walk there. You need to uh get it together, ma'am. So... Because if you want to lose this other 25 pounds and hit your goal of 50 pounds for this year, you hear me? What you going to do? You going to do what you got to. Am I right? So, I'm sorry, y'all. I just, I had to talk to myself. I mean, I, I do little personal videos, you know, like that, of me talking to myself. Once I found out I hit the 25 pounds, I said I was going to do a personal video, a personal message video to myself. I don't know if I should put it up here or not. Y'all let me know if I should put the video up here or not. Let me know if y'all want to see my personal message, my personal video message to myself now that I've, now that I know that I've lost 25 pounds, you know. And if y'all want to see it, after I do it, I'll put it up. I was going to make a video on how to do this, but this is so simple. It's just ground chicken and ground beef in the bottom. Shredded cheese of your choice. Letters. If you want to put sour cream, pico, salsa, 
guacamole or whatever you want to put in it, it's your choice. So, as we are going to put that in, but um, I know y'all been asking me for more cooking video, so I am going to do that. Now that um, now that I've done my video, you know, done my video for today. Well, Saturday this is previously recorded because it's Friday. But after I did my video for Saturday, I want to do a cooking video Sunday for Tuesday. And do the mukbang Thursday. I don't know. I don't know, but I am gonna do a cooking video next week. As y'all know, my upload days are Thursday and Saturdays, unless I feel like, you know, I'm going to get a wild hair off my butt and upload another day. This is good. Damn. This is going to fill me out, period. I don't need nothing else out of this because after I eat this and drink this water, I'm good. Because I'm going to watch a little TV. Watch a little TV. Do my little bed exercises. Get ready, you know. Do my bed exercises. Take my shower. And get ready for bed. Like it was good, y'all. It was super good. Let me go ahead and move it there. And get Thank you for coming in, watching and rocking with me as I enjoy the mukbang rubbles, healthy eating edition, aka the Keisha's healthy eating segment. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend. I hope you guys go ahead on and check out the other mukbang rubbles. Check them out because those ladies are doing their thing over there on their channels. Anyway, I'm going to get up out here. Again, I love y'all. Y'all take care. Be blessed. Always remember to smile, smile, smile. And with that being said, I'm going to push you down and pull you up later. Peace, guys.